Dun Dun and Number Seven. They've been going around doing interviews. Uh, Dun Dun definitely. Yeah. Um, they're not with. They're not with what you got going no more. They don't. They not. They feel like th that you didn't do right by them a lot of times. Uh, what is the issue? Why can't? Why didn't we see that hit come through them? Uh, when uh, they work with Mo Three. They was in the studio now, with Mo Three. Uh, they know. The, they know how to get there. What's the problem? Uh, it's it's a lot of work to really have to work. Yeah, we on Boss Talk One On One. Yeah, we gonna talk. <laughs> Some man, I, I just really like I say, man. You can't deny the fact, man. A lot of people say that Rainwater can't can't make another Mo Three. That's something that a lot uh, of people say. They say, where is the new talent at that is able to equate to that? Uh, let me tell Was you. it just some people don't even want to give Rainwater the credit for even being a part of making that success happen? Yeah, yeah, you can't take that away from me. Look, um, uh, let me tell you this. I, people always say that I never meet another Mo Three. I probably won't in my life because I I probably need, won't meet another person as talented and this hungry. So I meet a lot of rappers, and I try to work with a lot of rappers, but, you know, I ain't never met a nigga that wanted to be the best. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? If Mo3 was here right now, I wouldn't be doing interviews. Yeah. Because I because he'll be wanting to do He'd them. Be doing he'll them. be wanting to be number one. These niggas I be around right now don't give a damn about being number one. You understand what I'm saying? I see yeah. niggas wearing the same clothes chains when Mo3 was here. Wow. You know what so I'm saying? So if you find somebody that, um, not to say matches if Mo3 up to walk, him. If Mo3 walked in his door right now, he gonna sit there and say, nigga, you got braids. Nigga, you got this chain. Nigga, 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 you, I ain't stopped even pushing this music. If he ever heard heard this new album, eighty five percent of the songs on there, he would know where they came from. Wow! Because I took verses and put them right here, and took beats and stopped the beats, and I did a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. you know, he wouldn't know where they came from. You know what I'm saying? So, I never stopped. And, then, you know, I tried to push everybody. Some people say I was too hard on them niggas around me. And I was, though, because I was trying to get them skip a bunch of levels of the game so they don't have to deal with me and Mo3 did because Mo3 really died. It, Mo3 really died so anybody, everybody around him didn't have to go through the shit that me and him went through. Dun Dun and number seven. They've been going around doing interviews. Uh, Dun Dun, definitely. Yeah. Um, they're not with. They're not with what you got going no more. They don't. They not. They feel like that you didn't do right by them a lot of times. Uh, what is the issue? Why can't? Why didn't we see that hit come through them? Uh, uh, they work with Mo Three. They was in the studio now, with Mo Three. Uh, they know. The, they know how to get there. What's the problem? Uh, it's it's a lot of work to really have to work. Hey, hey, see we posted with pistols and rockets. Ain't making deposits. We putting that shit all in the box. With sweatpants on. Yeah. It wasn't bad, no. He was hungry and he, he was consistent. I, 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 it wasn't even bad, no image. Now, I'm shit. Nigga, big ass shit, you gotta perform. Shit, I'm just taking my shirt off. So you're more hungry. He was more hungry. So when niggas sit there and say, when niggas sit there and say, oh yeah, you, you'll never get make me another Mo3. Hell no, because the way he was hungry, it's ridiculous. We worked together. Nigga, we was more hungry. We, we, we was out trying to outdo each other. He, he knew how hungry I was. So how hungry he was, nigga, all you gotta do is give me the material. Do you regret passing Big X up? Man, I hate it. That's a good question. I hate it. That, he told he told me what a day and when we left the studio one day. You could have had me. <laughs> I was. I, I'm talking about. I'm talking about. I'm looking at the messages after after three. I mean, the, just recently, like, bro, you was hitting me up. Mm -hmm. Bro, just listen to my music. Fuck that shit, nigga. We on some HSM shit. Nigga, nigga, done done the something to be the biggest shit around here. This and that, this and that, this and that. This and I'm preaching that shit. I'm looking crazy now. So who you have as artists right now? Oh, uh, Bumpy, Bumpy one just. Went I know by. you have yeah, Bumpy, Baby C, uh, Pink, but um, I got, that's I got, it. I got my own label. Uh, I got two more people that I'm, I'm pushing. I'm pushing right now. Cause I see you up. be posting like you be looking for new people. Nah, nah, not really. Uh, I got my own label, so you know anybody need a distribution company or somewhere to drop their music, you know, with my promotion, that's cool. Uh, I got a, a platform, Empire. Empire gave my own label, so uh, I'm not really into the managing right now no more, but uh. I want to be able to managers can only do too too much. I never give a, a rapper who ain't never grinded two hundred fifty thousand again. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk.